to vlogmas today is sunday december 13th so vlogmas day 13 we are past the halfway point which is so wild it is just flying by this year today's vlog is pretty much gonna be just like christmas shopping extravaganza i did like 90 percent of my christmas shopping online already but there were a couple things i couldn't get online i have to get in person and i also want to get some stocking stuffers for steven because we always do stockings for each other and starting the day after tomorrow so tuesday actually we are not going to be leaving our house until after christmas so technically i could get some of those last few christmas gifts tomorrow but tomorrow steven and i are going to go together and do all of our grocery shopping for the next two weeks and so if i wanted to get anything for him i would have to be super super sneaky with it so my goal is today to cross everything off my list check it twice and then tomorrow we can just focus on groceries but i'm really i'm really excited if everything goes to plan we are gonna try to see my family on christmas which i just really thought that that was not in the cards for this year and that wasn't gonna happen and i'm really really grateful that it seems like we're gonna be able to in a way that feels safe and comfortable for us with everyone quarantining before and then we all also have appointments to get tested on december 22nd so as long as everything works out and those tests come back negative i i might see my parents and my brother on christmas and i don't want to cry i put on mascara today we're not gonna cry but um whenever you're getting a covid test it's really important to stay home for the time before the test and then the time after as well otherwise going out in public or seeing other people there those are opportunities for infection so then the test it, the test isn't really valid so we're following the cdc guidelines on that which means tomorrow is the last day we are going anywhere which means means today I need to finish my Christmas shopping. There were a lot of little things we had to figure out to make sure we were doing this in a way that felt safe and comfortable for us. Like I was supposed to have my anatomy scan on December 23rd, but that would have been like after I took the test. And so we rescheduled that for I think January 4th is when I'm going. And like my little brother, my little brother has a girlfriend now, which he said I can tell the vlog. So I have the permission to share that, but like he's not going to see his girlfriend for like two weeks. And oh, there were so many things we had to figure out. Point being, today is christmas shopping day so i am gonna start off the day with a starbucks i'm actually sitting in the starbucks parking lot right now <laughs> yes i'm putting on my seatbelt. i wasn't driving yet but um i figure it would be fun to start today off with a nice little treat a nice little starbucks mm. ah. <laughs> So I need to go to Kohl's and Target and to the Lego store. wonder who that one's for. And then also to a local nursery because someone on my list, I was going to get them a gift card to this local nursery that they like for like plants and landscaping and stuff. And they do gift cards, but they don't sell them online or over the phone or anything. So I have to go there to actually get the gift card. And then we also got something else for that person. But I was thinking maybe I'll try to find like a little succulent or something and I can like hang the gift card on the succulent. Also like the only person in my family who watches these vlogs is my mom so hi mom <laughs> i won't be showing any of her gifts in the vlog but i might talk about a few other people's gifts and then steven said he's not gonna watch this vlog so i can show you guys a couple of the things that i'm getting for him most of his big stuff i did already get an order online but i'll show you guys any of the fun things i get for him today okay so first stop is the lego store i'm outside right now and since they have everyone waiting outside the store they had one of the employees come out and like ask what specific things we're looking for so they can pull it and i already got one lego ship for steven on black friday and i'm really glad i did because that was the specific one that he had asked for and shortly after i bought it they sold out of it like everywhere online in stores but i wanted to get him another star wars lego set and literally every single one of the star wars lego ships is sold out online but there were a couple that said at the store near us that it was available in store so i'm here hoping i can get it she said that one of them the sith tie fighter they definitely have and then the other one the at at or atat -AT walker however you want to say it they might have so i don't think i'm gonna get him both of those it'll be one or the other i think he'd rather have the at at so if i can get that i will but if not sit tie fighter and then i might try and look and see if there are any like smaller sets like 10 or 15 dollar ones that i can just put in his stocking this is exactly the kind of little stocking stuffers i like to get steven there it is the at at thank you have a nice day thanks for your help you too. thanks okay i'm gonna see if i can get a thumbnail here with my giant bag but it's always embarrassing to do this in public okay embarrassment over i am 
just like shook right now that the Lego store actually had the ATAT -AT walker. I thought there was no way they were gonna have it. It's like sold out online and everything, but they did. And I got the second to last one. So definitely glad I came today. They said all the Star Wars Lego stuff is flying off the shelves. So very, very excited that I'm gonna get to give Steven that for Christmas. Also, in addition to that and like the little Lego Christmas stocking stuffer I got, this was free. It was free if you spent a certain amount of money, which I did because of the ATAT -AT walker. But like, how cute is this? It's a little like Lego ice skating rink. Steven loves this kind of stuff. Also, I think one of the things I didn't realize I missed with COVID is just like the little interactions with people when you're out and about, like just chatting with the Lego store guy. I was like, I missed this. I miss talking to people who aren't just Steven. Like when I go to Starbucks and I get to talk to the barista, that's like the social highlight of my day. <laughs> the next place we are going is the nursery, the gardening store. So let's hit it. We found the succulents. I feel like I should just go with the little aloe plant because then I can hang the gift card, like put it on a string and hang it off it. I feel like that'd be cute. Also confirmed, they do have gift cards. So yay. <laughs> All right, we are going with this fella looking good. Ooh, should I get a little white pot for him too? I feel like that'd be cute. See, I feel like putting the plant in the pot, I feel like that's a full on gift. <laughs> All right, we're getting the pot. Hopefully this is a good size for this plant because I am no plant expert. All right, we've got the goods and confirmed. The woman at the checkout said this is a great size pot for this plant. So we're doing good, we're halfway done. Now just Kohl's and Target. Oh no, succulent down, oh my gosh. Oh gosh, why did I put it on the seat? That was a horrible decision, Sierra. What were you thinking? Oh, okay, all right, well. Because my car is gonna get its first vacuum today. Oh my gosh, the gravel's like in the seatbelt hole. Oh gosh, this is a this is a big mess up. Gosh, I am like beyond irritated at myself for doing that. That was like a fully avoidable thing. Why did I put it on the seat? Oh man. That's probably gonna take me a while to like dig out of all the little crevices and vacuum and everything. And uh, I'm gonna call Steven. You know what? There's nothing Steven's gonna be able to do about this calling him, but I just wanna voice my frustrations at myself. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, you are on the vlog. I made a oopsie. Oh no, So. I got Jordan and Megan that plant so that we could like put the gift card for the nursery place in the plant. I just got them like a cute little succulent. And like an idiot, I put it on my seat instead of on the floor. And so, yeah, I know. So when I turned, it spilled all over. Like gravel was like the base of the plant and it is everywhere. I mean, it's like in the seatbelt holder. Well, the good news is it's a car. It can be cleaned. I know. Um, but... Congrats, you're a silly, silly girl. I know, I just needed to call you because I'm so mad at myself. It is definitely embarrassing, but uh, oh. uh, you know, all is well. Uh, when we come home, we can do a little vacuum date. Okay, thanks. I'll probably be home in like an hour and a half, I think. Not bad at all. <sighs> all right, I love you. Well, I love you too. Congrats on making a mistake. Thank you. Your idiot wife loves you lots. You're not an idiot. You're making a mistake. Thank you. Honestly, this might just be like the epitome of me becoming a suburban mom. But I feel like Kohl's is so underrated. They have so many good gifts and stocking stuffers here. And the prices are really good. Like they have a ton of like really fun and unique gifts from like the $5 to $25 price range. I'll show you guys a few of the things that I picked out. But I can't show everything because there are some things here for people who watch the vlogs. They had these karaoke mics that I feel like I've been seeing all over TikTok. So I'm getting one of these for someone. Also this wine holder for the bath. And then these two for Stephen stocking, these little like old school style glider planes that you make. I feel like he'll love that. And a desk tether ball set. This is, I think it's at $8. I feel like this is a fun little thing for him to have on his desk and a perfect little stocking stuffer. I got Stephen this Star Wars t-shirt with an X-wing on it. I got him this little NASA t-shirt. And the big 
thing that I'm not sure on. There is a person on my list who was obsessed with old school arcade games like this. And I found this little Miss Pac-Man one. And I, I think it also includes Pac-Man Plus, Dig Dug, and Galaga. But I'm not sure if it's saying that like these are the other ones that you can buy or if they all come in this. So if they all come in this one, I am, I think I am going to get this for the person on my list. But if it's just Miss Pac-Man, I think I'm going to pass. So I need to <laughs> look at this and figure it out. Nope. Okay other titles available. So this is only Miss Pac-Man. I think I'm gonna put this guy back. It's a really cool idea though. All right, it is dark outside now. I've got the Kohl's bag. Last place we are gonna head is Target. Wow, my forehead is shiny in this light. So here is my shopping list from Target. I'm hoping I can get everything and be in and out pretty quick. I need gift bags, wrapping paper, bows, name tags, more Gatorade. My OBGYN had suggested that I drink a Gatorade to try and keep my electrolytes up. Cinnamon toothpaste. So I saw this as a suggestion from a lot of you guys in the comments when I had asked for tips on how to not vomit when I brush my teeth. And then my friend Skylar texted me and was like, cinnamon toothpaste, it saved me. And then just stocking stuffers for Steven. So I was gonna get him like candy, gum, maybe some beef jerky, little things like that. And then I'll peruse the like one to five dollar bins when you walk in to see if there's any little knickknacks that I can throw in Steven's stocking. So really most of the things I'm getting at Target aren't even gift related, just the stocking stuffers. So other than the stocking stuffers, I'm officially done with my Christmas shopping, which is so wild. I have so many packages at home now that need to be wrapped. And then also all the gifts that I bought today. So I need to make sure I get enough wrapping paper and then also enough gift bags for the oddly shaped gifts. You know, it's a crazy thought. One year from now, I'm gonna be shopping for Christmas presents for baby girl. <laughs> oh, that makes it really real, really, really real. <laughs> all right, let's montage this Target trip. Here we go. everything on my list except for the cinnamon toothpaste and I am so tired. It literally just hit me like a truck like maybe 10 minutes ago but I am very sleepy, very tired. It's only like 6 o'clock but I, I feel like it's midnight. I cannot find the cinnamon toothpaste for the life of me. I don't know if they don't carry it or I just am not able to look at it. I think I am just gonna check out with everything else that I got and order some cinnamon toothpaste online. <laughs> I am home. Stephen is up in his office so I can organize all the stuff and then find a hiding place for this. I don't know where I'm gonna hide this that he's not gonna see it. I'm thinking maybe the spare room upstairs, the closet there. That's where I keep a lot of like my filming equipment and stuff so he never really goes in there. And then I'm just gonna try and wrap this as soon as possible maybe tomorrow or Tuesday when he's working. But I'm gonna go through the Kohl's bag and the Target bag and condense all the stuff for Steven into this bag. That way I just have to hide the one thing and then he's clear to come downstairs. <laughs> all right, here is all the Steven stuff. Let's go hide it. All right, hopefully he doesn't come in here before I have time to wrap it. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Your first time on the vlog today. I miss you. I miss the dogs. I am exhausted. <laughs> It was a very long day shopping, but I got literally every last present on the list for you, for other people. Mm. So I'm feeling, I'm feeling good about it. I feel like there's one gift we're still missing, but I'll talk about that. After. Wait, what do you think it is? Oh, well, no, we're gonna order that online. Okay. And I actually did get something for that today. For that, that entity. Yes, that I will show you today. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I would say today was my successful, quote unquote, not Christmas Eve, Christmas Eve. Tomorrow we'll be going out to do all our grocery shopping. So considering how tired I am. And, and it's the a post office. We got to mail some things out. Oh, that's right. That's right. We need to do that tomorrow. Which 
cannot forget that. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, I think I'm just gonna end the vlog here because I am so tired, Steven. I literally went, I thought I was at my car in the parking lot and I was trying to do the kick assist open thing literally at someone else's car for so like a actually, minute. Do you actually use that? Yeah. Oh, uh, cool. <laughs> but it wasn't my car, so it didn't work. <laughs> but yeah, luckily I am not the one editing this vlog. My lovely editor, Mario, is. So I will be sending off this footage and then going to sleep early. Wow. Last night, we, we were planning on going to bed relatively early and then after we finished watching The Grinch, you wanna come say hi? After we finished watching The Grinch, we watched The Prom on Netflix, which was really, really yeah. great. Last night was like an unintended late night we're party. We stayed up till like 12.30. Like the movie finished at like one o'clock. Yeah. Well, it ended up 12.50. Really? And it took I us like it. half an hour to get in the bed, and the next thing you know, it was like almost one, and I was like. Party animals. Ah! <laughs> So, no, it was almost two. We went to bed late. Oh my gosh. Well, tonight I will be going to bed early, making up for that time. So we will see you guys tomorrow in Vlogmas Day 14. That's wow. That's your one job is the day, what day it is every day. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye.